second day. Second day. What's up, you slimy motherfuckers? I'm back for the second day. Come on now. Progress. Progress. Two years? Come on now. I ain't gonna hold it though. I ain't gonna hold it though. But um, we back with the Metal Gear. Second day in a row. I told y'all boys tomorrow. It's tomorrow. It's tomorrow. Okay. Yesterday was the 8th. Today is the 9th. I think today is the 9th. I'm recording this shit at... Where's my phone? Where's my phone? Okay, fuck my phone. It is... It's 1201. It's 1201. So... I made it. By the time this recording is done, it's gonna be 1 o'clock, okay? We made it. We made it. Nigga. This is made. For real, for real, for real. We back with another video on Metal Gear Solid, bro. I told y'all yesterday, this is gonna be boss fight time. I think we fight Ocelot and the Pain. We fight Ocelot and the Pain. So, that's what I'm gonna give y'all today. Now, if I gotta skip through a whole bunch of cutscenes to get y'all there, me, I know you don't wanna sit through a whole movie again. If you didn't sit through that movie, go back. It makes sense. Kinda. You won't understand it. But go back and watch that first video. Give it a like. If you don't watch it, at least give it a like. For me. For you. For us. So we left off on hearing my boy. So my boy got suffering from deep cuts. So we're gonna have to stitch them up. Bleeding. We're gonna have to patch that up. No bandages applied. Not yet disinfected, so we gotta disinfect that hole. One, uh, no, okay, and then we gotta stitch that boy up, right? That boy needs some ointment, no, no, that boy, ointment. and then we need some bandages, and then we just do that shit all over again. Right, this one, this one, disinfect it. Okay, tight shit. This, this, this. This, 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 Good job, Snake. We're coming to get you now. Just stay where you are. We'll drop a recovery balloon. Can you set it up? So how does it feel to be a pay yesterday? The this is Snake. Do you read me? Loud and clear. Glad to see you landed safely. I got blown pretty far off target. Snake, let's go over your mission objectives one more time. Rescue Sokolov. Find out what's happened to the Shagahod. Then destroy it. And finally, eliminate the boss. Eliminate the boss. This mission will be codenamed Operation Snake Eater. Because I'll be taking on the boss and her Cobra unit, right? Don't forget about Colonel Volkin. I'm not a hired killer. I know, but that was the Kremlin's demand. Demand? You mean it wasn't just a request? What's it to us if the Khrushchev regime is threatened by the Colonel and his faction? 
If supporting the current regime helps us avoid a nuclear exchange, then that's what we'll do. And what are the CIA's demands? Our priorities are the rescue of Sokolov and the destruction of the Shagahod. Roger that, Major Tom. Hold on, Snake. What now? I'm changing my code name. It turns out Tom wasn't the most auspicious choice. What do you mean? Well, the truth is, when I chose my code name, I picked the wrong one. The wrong one? Did you ever see the movie The Great Escape? It came out last year. I must have missed that one. Anyway, it's based on a true story about prisoners who escaped from a POW camp in Nazi Germany. The prisoners dig three tunnels as part of their plan, but the Nazis find two of the tunnels before they're finished. The prisoners succeed in escaping by using the last remaining tunnel. The names of those three tunnels were Dick, Harry, and Tom. I get it. You used the name of the tunnel they escaped in as your code name because you thought it would bring you good luck. Yes, that's exactly right. At least, that was the plan. But? But I got the name wrong. The one they escaped in was Harry. Tom was one of the unlucky tunnels. It was discovered by the Nazis before it was finished. I watched the movie again just to make sure. In fact, I even ordered the actual film from the movie company. Yeah, it doesn't sound like the greatest name to use. So what should I call you? Hmm. You know, let's just use Zero, like we've been doing all along. All right, then. Major Zero it is. We'll start over from square one. From square zero. My frequency is 140.85. Oh, I almost forgot. Paramedic is with us again on this mission. Is this her last chance, too? If we fail, she'll have her medical license revoked. It's more or less the same kind of fate. So, you know, we got thrown over the, the, the river. So, you know, we got thrown in the river by old girl boss. She broke our arm, broke everything pretty much. We fell into the river and we had to patch ourselves up. They sent us a recovery balloon. We went home. We came back to finish a mission, which is the mission that he just told you about, which is killing the Cobra unit. Because I'll be taking on the boss and her Cobra unit, right? And Colonel Volgan. Don't forget about Colonel Volgan. Uh, so we're here to kill them. This is our last chance to get Sokolov back. We gotta do this shit. Let's do it. This is Snake, Major Zero. I read you, Snake. I was ambushed by the boss. You were what? The drone's been shot to hell. It's up in flames. That's not good. Enemy scouts are gonna come looking for you. Yeah, I know. But what was the boss doing here in the first place? There's gotta be a leak somewhere. No, that's impossible. The man the boss is working with, Volgan, isn't exactly on speaking terms with Khrushchev. I lost my gun. The boss destroyed it. Snake, I know how you're feeling. It's hard for me to believe, too, that a legendary hero like the boss would go over to the Russians, which he'd double-cross us like this. But that's how it is, and if you don't accept it, you'll never be able to beat her. That's not the problem. In terms of sheer technique, I'll never be able to beat her. I know that all too well. You've got to do it, Snake. She's your enemy and your objective. Enemy? We were together for ten years, and now you tell me she's my enemy? Enough. Hurry to the factory where Adam is waiting. Scouts have probably already been sent out to investigate the explosion. You've lost your weapon, right? That means you've got no chance of winning in a battle situation. Whatever you do, don't let them see you. Alright, so... We got some mercenaries coming. Gotta hide in the bushes. here we have evidence of an enemy intruder commence alert formation acknowledged sending reinforcements use uh -huh. extra caution okay i think i think they know i'm here yeah it ain't, it ain't go it ain't go too well this ain't go too well Yeah, bitch ass niggas. See, the thing is, the thing, the thing is, is like, 
I'm not a sneaky motherfucker, bro. I'm not. I'm okay, my fault, my fault, my fault, my fault. Let me tee up, let me tee up, let me tee up. Let me tee up, let me tee up. Nah, you can see that, nigga. For sure. As long as you know. Snap that boy neck. He don't know what to do. Well, he did. But he still don't know what to do. Come here. Who's that? Mm -mm. I'ma dice your ass up. Keep on getting up. Cool. Alright, we good. We good. We not even we ain't even seen. We ain't even seen. We good. Alright. So y'all get kind of a boss fight y'all kind of get a boss fight just a little peek need them no so we didn't find adam adam this is not adam this is somebody this completely different plan. what happened to adam oh he tells What's you your code name it's snake I thought I'd skip that scene. Snake, huh? Well, I'm Eva. Are you here to tempt me? What happened to Adam? Colonel Volgan is a very suspicious man. He decided Adam wasn't the right person for this mission. And That's not true. <laughs> yes. Why? Because I can do things he can't. I heard you used to be a code breaker for the NSA. I was. Four years ago, I defected to the Soviet Union with Adam. Mauser military. The broom handle. It packs quite a punch. Nice to have when you're on a bike. You held it sideways and used the muzzle jump to create a horizontal sweep. That was impressive. Bet you've never seen that technique in the West. It's imitation, isn't it? Yeah. It's a Chinese Type 17 pistol. Around here, even that's hard to come by. Don't worry, though. The one I've got for you is American-made. Forty-five, huh? Hmm. Incredible. Do you like it? The feeding ramp is polished to a mirror sheen. The slide's been reinforced. And the interlock with the frame is tightened for added precision. The sight system is original too. The thumb safety is extended to make it easier on the finger. A long type trigger with non-slip grooves. A ring hammer. The base of the trigger guard's been filed down for a higher grip. And not only that, nearly every part of this gun has been expertly crafted and customized. Where'd you get something like this? I grabbed it from a Western munitions armory. It probably used to belong to one of your officers, and there are more where that came from. You had this with you, didn't you? Better take this too. What's that? A disguise to make you look like a scientist. A disguise? Yes. You're here to rescue Sokolov, right? Sokolov's still safe, then? Yes. He's being forced to continue his work on the Shagohod. Where? At the lab. They've got a whole army of scientists there developing new weapons. Security is tight, but if you disguise yourself as a scientist, you might be able to sneak in. Can we get Sokolov out of there? We'll see, won't we? Tell me how to get to the lab. The safest way in is from the rear. First, you'll need to head north through the jungle. You'll come to a heliport used for shipping materials. Pass the heliport and continue north and there will be a large crevice. Descend into that area and you'll reach a cave. Move through the cave and you will arrive at a mangrove swamp. 
After the swamp, there'll be a warehouse. Make your way through the warehouse, and you'll come out just south of the lab. Got it. And just what are you doing there? <laughs> In close-range combat, a knife can sometimes be more useful than a gun. By doing this, I'll be able to hold a knife at the same time and still keep the gun steady. That way, I can instantly switch between a gun battle and a knife fight. Right, let's get going. Wait a minute. What now? You must be tired. Why don't you take a little rest? I'll be fine. You'll never make it in your condition. It's a jungle out there. There's still an hour before dawn. It's dangerous to be out in the jungle at night without a guide. What about you? I have to get back. I can't be gone for too long. They'll start to suspect something. Don't worry. I'll keep you updated over the radio. That's it? My orders are to provide you with information. Nothing more. Hmm. You look disappointed. All right, then. I'll do something special for you. I'll stand watch until dawn. Now be a good boy and lie down. What's the matter? I don't know you well enough to trust you. How well do you have to know me to trust me? I don't know if I can trust anybody. Gonna get that? All right, so I gotta take out eight people before I can even move on to the next area. This is probably gonna be a, 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 a jump, a little fast forward. So y'all boys let me focus up real quick.
All right. That's all of them. That was, that could have been a little cleaner. That could have been a little cleaner, but you know, I did my thing. You feel me? <laughs> okay, this area is a swamp, right? I'm telling, I'm, I'm talking about if you ever need food, this is where you gotta be. This is where you need to be if you need food. Thermal goggles. For now. Thermies. Come on now. You know how I like it. Yeah. Always put on thermal goggles in a lake. We good. She's just telling me about traps. I ain't worried about them goddamn traps. She's just telling me about traps. You know, there's one crazy thing about this game that I really, really love. So, if you don't eat your food in real life, it, this game goes on real time. So, if you don't eat your food, then your food will spoil because it's going off a of real time. Like, that's one cool thing about this fucking game. Oh. Ain't no point, I'm gone. Okay. Okay. So this is where I'm supposed to be. Alright. There's some things that I need from here. Uh, I need water. Water suit. I need a water suit. The water uniform. Can you say that for some other reason? Oh, hungry. Okay. 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 When you get hungry, your aim literally starts wobbling. Or you can't, you can't aim right, and it's not steady. Steady. All right. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! It's three of them. Okay. One bear for three. Where's I? Right. I ain't jumping. Okay, I need this. Actually, can I jump on it? Let me know if y'all would like to see me play Metal Gear Solid 5. Like, it, Metal Gear Solid 5 is like that. It don't have all the cutscenes and stuff like that. But it's a it's a pretty decent Metal Gear. I like it a lot. Things that we all need. All right, y'all. We here. First boss fight. First boss fight. This is the revolver boss fight. Ah, you're here at last. Looks like the boss's info was right. Twenty-eight. 
Twice now you've made me taste bitter defeat. Point the cobras, but you're mine now. Man, all fuck all that, man. Us. Man, what's up, bro? You talking too much and shit, bro? Yeah, off the rip. That's some whole ass shit. Hey, get your boys, bro. I don't give a fuck about none of that. Hey, this nigga kind of nasty. Cause he can ricochet bullets off the rocks, bro. Okay, I'm with it. I'm still with it. You fool! You won't get away from me. My hat. I'm not worried about none of it. Oh, I should have took off my suppressor. Now take it back off, bitch. It probably would have been easier to um get him. I mean, it probably would have been easier to tranquilize him, but I mean, I'm not really worried about tranquilizing him because it takes you long. Fuck, I lost him. Where is he, y'all? I see him, I see him, I see him, I see him, I see him. Dumbass. Yes. Fuck it! I'm with it! Part of a duel. I'm with it. That's some bullshit. That's some bullshit. That's some bullshit. I was with it, bro. I did that shit, bro. That nigga lame, bro. He he, he did it too early. He was, he was too early. I'm that nigga, bro. Where is he? He's back there, right? Oh, this nigga is a tweaker. That's some whole ass shit. That's some whole ass shit, but it's okay. It's whatever. Oh, who all talk, nigga? You you don't even know who I am, boy. Dick shot. What the fuck you talking about? Bullshit. 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 Time to eat, bro. What you talking about? Yeah. Woo! Ricochet. Ricochet. That's some whole shit, bro. Give a fuck. That's how I used to do it back in uh, when I was a kid. I am fighting fair, bitch. What you talking about? I should shoot your ass back there. Hold on. Hey, you talking about? Hey, you talking about? What are you talking about? Get out of here. Damn it. Woo. That was Found a little racist. This. It was a little racist. Again. Ah! 
So my eyes just gonna adjust to the darkness, nigga. Okay, plus I kinda kinda already know where to go. Kinda. torch back here. There it is. Yes, sir. beyond your imagination this boy <laughs> angelic as hell angelic angelic let's get started like for a big guy this nigga is like this nigga doing back like he learned this as a child oh, oh fuck that fuck that fuck that fuck that Hold it. Oh fuck. Hold it. Get these fish. Cause I'ma need them. I ain't tripping. I ain't hiding from your old bitch ass. Hold oh, that for me. I should look away from them every time. Are you just gonna give me this? Oh, okay. I was about to say, are you? Uh, is he just giving me this? Usually he'll like, you know, uh, armor up with the bees, but he didn't armor up with the bees this time. This nigga's disgusting, bro. I hate looking at him. This game is so stupid, bro. This game is so stupid, bro. But I love it. 
bullet hornets or something like that. I forgot what they're called. Oh, fuck. It's not on him. Fuck that, fuck that. Huh? Uh-uh, hell no. Stay your bitch ass right there. I told y'all this bitch don't play. Oh, now you moving, huh? I'm not worried about these goddamn bees. Don't worry about it. I'm not worried about it, bro. I'm not worried about it, bro. Oh, you bitch. And these ugly horns, nigga. I'm not worried about these shits, bro. Yeah, bitch, have what? I'm not worried about that shit, boy. I am not worried about that shit, boy. I am not worried about that shit, boy. I am Russian food. Russian food is so disgusting in here. Hey, bro. I am not worried about that shit, bro. Bet. Big G, double O G, triple O G. Ah! Fun fact, <laughs> fun fact, if you were to kill, I mean not kill, if you were to take them out, the, the bosses out, without killing them, which is like using tranquilizers and stuff like that, if you were to take them out doing that, then you can get their outfits. I'll try to do it with the next boss, just switch it up for y'all, alright. I'm gonna get to where we see the end, and then, um... Probably gonna leave this episode as is. Hey, bro, I ain't gonna lie. This nigga like snake, like, <laughs> if I could get a sponsor from like Metal Gear, bro, or like Konami or anything like that, bro, like anything snake related, bro, Metal Gear related, bro. Like, I like Revengeance. I like Revengeance. Um,. All the Metal Gear, bro. I love them. Metal Gear in general, bro. I've been a fan for like... I can't even describe how many years, bro. Like, for real, for real. I can't even truly give you a number. But it's been since a child, bro. Like, f forever. No worries, you ain't coming. <laughs> no worries, my friend. No one's coming.
just have it. Oh shit, I forgot the suppressor. Uh, and I'm not going back. I'm not going back. I'm definitely not going back. But I did forget the suppressor, bro. Oh fuck. Okay, I took out his radio, right? Cool. Uh, that'll do it. Oh, no. Shit. Whatever, I shot him. It'll go down soon. This is HQ. Patrol here. I don't think they should be coming from this way. Are they? No. Okay. They came from downstairs. They usually do come from downstairs. Sometimes. <laughs> Sometimes they don't. <laughs> Sometimes they do come for that fucking door, and I get fucked every time. Okay. So, there's a knockout. I'm gonna grab this suppressor. Because okay. I need it. I really need it real bad. Real bad, real bad, real bad. Real bad, real bad, real bad. Because my suppressor is almost gone. Which I am gonna take out this suppressor room, because for the next boss area. Uh, which is coming up soon. It will probably be the beginning. Well, not, I won't say the beginning of the next episode. But it probably will be, um, soon in the first the, uh, third episode. Of this game? This is the boss arena, actually. It's filled with traps, <laughs> like a motherfucker. Uh, as you can see, it's filled with traps. Filled with traps. So I have to be careful in this area. But no spoilers, for real, for real. Um, but I am going to leave this episode here. Yeah, 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 yeah. You seen this big ass warehouse area and shit, but I gotta leave it here, y'all, because the next episode is actually going to be a very long boss fight. It's going to take me time to fire out fight this boss. So, um, thank you guys for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. You know, you slime motherfuckers. I need y'all. You know, show me appreciation like I show y'all appreciation. I put these videos out for y'all. I need y'all to smash the like button. I need y'all to put that bell on so when y'all hear goddamn boodoo you know uno has posted you feel me the slimy gamer you feel me uh little burlesi action uh you feel me so um much appreciate y'all for watching this is probably going to be another 50 something minute video i don't know yet i don't know yet but um thank you guys for watching i really appreciate you for being here like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what y'all would like to see further. Uh, if it's Resident Evil, Elden Ring, I'm going to probably play Elden Ring on the channel either way it go. Uh, Resident Evil, Elden Ring, more uh, Metal Gear, Metal Gear Solid Five, um, everything. Let me know what y'all want to see, um, and I'll try to f get it. <laughs> so uh, thank y'all, boys. Appreciate y'all for watching. See y'all tomorrow.